London is a very green city. In parks, there are many people relaxing, reading books, playing with friends, and sleeping. We think it's interesting and different from our country, Japan. Above the many other famous parks, we chose Russell Square, which is located near the British Museum and our school, SOAS. Why don't you explore a beautiful park in London with us? We're all falling and we need a place to hide. London has around 40% public green spaces, including 3,000 parks totaling 35,000 acres. The most famous parks include Green Park, Hyde Park, St. James Park, and Richmond Park. Russell Square was a favorite area of some of London's finest writers, poets, and artists, including T.S. Eliot and Virginia Woolf. We are curious about how people spend their time in the park. Let's listen to the voices of people in Lasse Square.、Um, about twice a day, usually before and after work.、Um, I stay and working from home, so come in the middle of the day, but yeah, we live close by, so very often.、And、this is my first time at this park,、uh, but I go to parks quite regularly, maybe twice a week. About at least once a month, if not twice. Well, this is actually my first time here, but after today, I think it's a very beautiful park, so I'm probably going to come back. I probably come here maybe once every two days. Almost every day. I'm with my dog, so just running around, throwing balls, throwing sticks. <laughs>、uh, usually eating food,、uh, catching up with friends. Uh, and just relaxing, lounging.、Yeah. Um, this is usually where I eat my lunch and where I'll get any homework done that I can get done and read. This is where I go whenever I have free time. We live really close、um, and it's fairly secure,、um, so my dog doesn't run out,、um, and it's big enough yeah, to have a good run around. Uh, because it's close to my university and where I'm studying, so convenience. Because my flat is very nearby.、Um, it's also very clean, like sometimes you find parks which are dirty. Also, it's quite a small park, like parks like Hyde Park and Regent's Park are quite large, and often you don't get many tourists in one place, whereas here you have、um, like, sta- like underground stations there and over there and over there, so we have a lot of tourists and different types of people coming through. This park is really close to where I go to classes at IES Center, and、um, it's just a really nice atmosphere and lots of room to just spread out. It never feels crowded. Yeah. Green space is really good to relax in, so for well being,、uh, it's very good for the environment. It helps clean the air with trees,、uh, and it's also aesthetically pleasing. So, yeah. It's a nice place to have lunch with the family. <laughs> it's atmosphere, it's just got the most gorgeous atmosphere, I think. And I read、um, one of、um, Virginia Woolf's novels, which was called Mrs. Dalloway, and you can hear her speaking.、Uh, it's just as if she was still here in, in the square. <laughs> I'm. Typically, a country girl, I usually I don't spend so much time in cities, but here is where I can find green and trees and kind of my refuge for nature. Yes, it is fairly important.、Uh, very important? Yes, it is. I love it. It's extremely important for me. Really important for us. It's important for me. Very important to me. Very important. It's very important. Through making our documentary, we were touched by the kindness of people in the park and found that London has many brilliant green spaces, which make people feel relaxed and refreshed. As you can see, parks are one of the important parts of their lives, and they are living with nature. Did you enjoy watching our documentary?